Hey guys, how's it going? Yes. <laughs> Happy mail has come for me. And um actually I'm really excited about this one. This one's from London. And well I've never been but my sister told me it's very very nice there. And well I have been to their airport. Does that count? <laughs> very nice airport. There's a Harry Potter um, gift shop. Very impressed. That was really cool. I took like a lot of pictures there. <laughs> and I have food there. So I guess I was kind of in London before. Yeah, depending on like, you know, how you define being at a place before or not. <laughs> so, um, this one is from Renee and I got the complete underground collection and that was kind of intense experience because I was like, oh, I, since like, you know, according to my mom, I'm supposed to kind of get different colors and then so now I'm like I try to get things that's put into a set by the shop owner and so I don't only pick the colors that I like you know the blues and the purples and so I was like oh that's a really nice collection that there's like so many different uh, range of colors so awesome I'm going to place I'm going to buy it when it's up and then with a the time difference by the time I open it I was like one left what one left <laughs> I was like oh my god I have to get it right away that was stressful <laughs> and um so as the first hand, Renee actually offered the um, color shift um, sample for all of us, I guess. And ta da! This is the one that I've got. And it's Phoenix. <gasps> oh. Do you see that sudden change right there? Yeah. I love color shift. <laughs> That's so cool to look at. But then I still cannot figure out a way to use them in paintings to make them look cool. Because like I feel like they work so much better in letterings when the area is smaller. Or maybe I do mini paintings. That might be the answer. We will see. So, what's in the underground collection? We shall see. London. Wow, my sister's got to be totally jealous. It's her favorite place in the world. Other than Canada, that is. I think. <laughs> so, this is business card. I will definitely enjoy it. Thank you. I love it when like shop owners, they actually share your art. It's kind of like, you know, um, like more interactive. So that's always nice, always a plus. All right, so that's there and there's a new set that's called Baby Yoda and I love Yoda. <laughs> I think it, he might be the my favorite character in Star Wars, so very tempted. All right, let's see. Logo plus. I love I just love it when there's logo on the box. Are you ready to meet them? I am. Yeah. Oh, well, there's no swatch card 
like um, it's not already swatched, but it's already prepared. So we might get to that today since already prepared. <laughs> All right, can you see so many different colors there? One, two, three. And it's like nicely secured. That's always a plus too, because like. I kind of cannot stand it when the color itself is like fallen out of the half pan. It bothers me a lot, a lot. <laughs> All right, and there's no actually unwrapping to do, but check them out. They are all named and lined up and everything's facing that way. That's how I organize it too. It's always all the names to the left or to towards me so yay <laughs> all right let's see so the first color it's um Bakerloo and it's a brown golden very strong magnet um golden brown ish color very nice that's that <laughs> and there is central very nice red look at that sparkle all right and then circle I wonder why it's named circle is it like um, wedding rings some people get it in gold right like yellow gold goldish is that why I'm just wondering the name and red is like a center of attention <laughs> maybe I don't know <laughs> district ooh pink Ham Hammersmith and ooh Jubilee I like this color all right, and Metro Bling. Very nice. Northern. I got so many of them that's called this name, but they are all different colors. I have them in blue shade and a greenish blue shade and, um, like green green bright neon green kind of color so that's cool this this one is sparkly black all right all right okay <gasps> this one wasn't face down <laughs> And like, it's okay because all I need to do is turn it around. <laughs> uh, you, get, you guys know how I feel about orange. So yeah, let's just put that down. <laughs> Pick a three. Oh, it looks so rich, right? Royal. Okay. And Victoria. Oh, it's the same name as my cousin, Victoria. Very nice. <gasps> I like this too. <laughs> and this one too. What to do? Hey, I love the name. What to do? <laughs> oh my god, let's try them. Let's try them right now and finish my swatch. Ready? Okay, this one was C. Orange, like you were the only one that wasn't face, like your name wasn't face down. Now you can see why I don't want to, no, <laughs> that's, that's not even the reason. All right, let's line them up and do swatching time. I do need to preserve them. And, okay, I think I have enough water, just enough water for Getting them pretty wet. So let's 
so exciting. Or maybe I don't. I need to refill the water. Because I wasn't expecting that we're gonna do swatching, so. Oh, it's a surprise. Okay, yeah, I, I'm out of water. <laughs> and not to worry, just have to dab like that. Maybe two, just to get it enough water. So exciting. They look so pretty together. And I love the name. It looks it sounds so um badass <laughs> underground collection. Yes, my um you know bad girl side of me doesn't go very far I guess even like underground collection it's like badass to me <laughs> they look so pretty together very excited and that's a very bad idea because the, the magnet is pretty strong and I just put them on the on the table so let's gotta be careful not to um, knock them over Wish me luck. Okay. Okay, there's one more thing that I need to do before we start. Um, <clears throat> it's just me being me. Don't mind me. <laughs> It's gotta be quick. I just need to have a guideline, sort of. Oh, it's too short. One second. Spelling on me, I'm going not going to like bother me. Just gotta do it. Just gotta do it. And let the camera focus so we can see the magic. Okay. Here goes nothing. I think it appears to be more gray than um, brown once you um, I should use it <laughs> alright oh very nice rich red and even the sparkle is red okay I do need to keep them safe give me a second let me uh, okay let me Oh, what do you know? I always say there, there needs to be logos, but I guess not. <laughs> okay, <laughs> now I feel safe. All right, next circle, come on over. It's your turn. It's totally golden. Very nice. District. It's a total Christmas green. Christmas colors again. Awesome. Christmas. I love Christmas. Wow, it's so rich. I love the color. Okay, I can totally see doing painting with these colors because like um, the base color is very, very rich. Pink, 
I'm actually really excited about this one too. Hammersmith. It's a very sakura look. Oh, and the sparkles, I will give you guys a close up as soon as I'm done. Maybe I dry a little bit. And I love the name for this one. Jubilee. Wow, impressed. Alrighty. Cheers. Got one. My trouble. Okay, it looks kind of like purplish brown to me, and it's a rich chocolate brown on the paper. It might be the sparkles. All right, Northern, come here. Come here, baby. It's your turn. I'm excited about this one. I might have put too much water on it because this one has a piddle top and hopefully it doesn't drip on this side. Very nice. Very, very nice. I think I'm going to put this one on the there. We're almost at the blues. Water overflow. One second. <laughs> All right. Yeah, you know, it's orange. <laughs> okay, that was me. This is a very nice orange. Oh my God, where are the blues? <laughs> Deep breath. I, I, I have a feeling I'm going to love this one. So here goes nothing. Wow. It's um. It's wow. <laughs> wow. I love it. Okay, Victoria. It looks like a princess dress, Cinderella's dress. Okay, this one looks totally mermaid. Let's give it a try. Are you ready? In a very different angle. Let's uh, do it this way. Wow, are you serious? This one's gorgeous. <laughs> this one's gorgeous. Okay, <sighs> excitement over. Oh, I do have um, Phoenix to try too. Let me grab a small piece of paper. We're going to do it right here. I'm making the like proper little swatches to put it in my team. So this is a leftover, the size isn't right. <laughs> but I might, I will redo it later on. So it's all cool. That's, I didn't read. Pre-soak it, so let's give it a nice rub so we can get enough color. That's a really generous amount of 
um, colors. And since our color shifts are usually more expensive, so yay. Sparkle, so much sparkle. Let's tap it, tap it, tap it, tap it, tap it. All right, done for real this time. <laughs> done for real this time. Okay, let's let it dry first. Let's take a look at this babes first. And I'm actually kind of happy about my swatch. See, it doesn't have to be in a perfect circle. Come on. <laughs> Oh, what's your, which one's your favorite? Let's take a look. Um, I have to say, um, I'm actually really impressed by Metropol. Well, you know that I love those ones. So I'm going to talk about other colors. <laughs> so this one definitely and the pink is actually really nice. And Jubilee, it has a very nice silver tone to it. And the Christmas colors are really... I love them all, and maybe except that one, but that's just me not liking orange, but that's a really nice sparkly orange. I'm sure I'll find a use for it. It's like, you always need all the colors, right? It, it, they will they, they, that it's like I do use orange just try not to I guess <laughs> well thanks for watching I hope you enjoyed the introduction for Renee's watercolors and our little quick swatching section and a proper one will be prepared for this set for sure and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.